resistors in series. What happens if we connect the resistors in series? What is the value of current? Let us try to understand with an activity. Join three resistors in series. Connect them with a battery of 6 volts, an ammeter and a plug key with connecting wires. Plug the key and note the ammeter reading. Change the position of ammeter in the circuit anywhere and take readings. We can conclude that in series combination of resistors, the ammeter reading is same anywhere in a circuit. Now connect voltmeter in parallel across the ends A and F. Take voltmeter readings. Take out the plug key and disconnect the voltmeter. Now connect the voltmeter across the ends A and B. Plug the key and take the readings of voltmeter say V1 is equal to 3 volts. Similarly, connect the voltmeter across C and D and E and F. Take readings in each case say V2 is equal to 2 volts and V3 is equal to 1 volts. Add V1, V2 and V3. We get 6 volts. You will observe that the total potential difference across a combination of resistors in series is equal to the sum of potential difference across the individual resistors. That is V is equal to V1 plus V2 plus V3. Applying the Ohm's law to the entire circuit, we have V is equal to IR on applying Ohm's to the three resistors separately. We further have V1 is equal to IR1, V2 is equal to IR2 and V3 is equal to IR3. Substituting 1, 2, 3 and 4 in equation A, we get IR is equal to IR1 plus IR2 plus IR3 or we get RS is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. We can conclude that when resistors are connected in series, the resultant resistance RS equals to sum of the individual resistances.